Hey guys, these ampules contain chloroauric acid. I'll be using these orange crystals to synthesize explosive gold and show you the mysterious purple smoke that was featured in an article on I Love Science last year. Over 500 years ago, alchemists discovered that mixing gold dissolved in aqua regia with an ammonia solution produces a precipitate with explosive properties even greater than gunpowder. What's even more fascinating is that when this substance explodes, it releases purple smoke, a phenomenon that remained unexplained until recently. A team of scientists from the University of Bristol finally uncovered the reason behind this unusual effect. Gold fulminate is obtained by adding ammonia solution to a solution of gold chloride. For this, I dissolved chlorauric acid crystals in water. Then, while stirring, I carefully added the ammonia solution drop by drop. As the reaction proceeded, an orange precipitate started forming in the mixture. This precipitate is gold fulminate. Now we just need to filter and dry it. Since this substance is not soluble in water, and the substances used for synthesis are soluble, then water is best suited for washing. Now that we have gold fulminate, let's test it and see that mysterious purple smoke. For the first experiment, I put some of this powder on a hot plate and waited a little. A small explosion occurred, leaving behind purple marks, but the smoke wasn't very visible. Perhaps it will be better seen in slow motion. Even at 1000 frames per second, or even 12000 frames, the purple smoke is still hard to see. Let's try touching it with a hot glass rod. Yeah, this method is much more effective. Let's watch it in slow motion. Now you can clearly see the mysterious purple smoke that puzzled chemists and alchemists for centuries. To finish off, I burned the remaining gold fulminate with a simple butane torch. Look at the massive purple stain left by just a tiny amount of powder. Let's use the butane torch again and then look at this combustion in slow motion. According to the research of British chemists, the purple color in the smoke comes from gold nanoparticles. The scientists collected the smoke using copper meshes and analyzed it with a transmission electron microscope. The diffraction pattern they obtained confirmed through careful analysis of the ring placement and intensity, but the particles were pure metallic gold. And finally, I decided to check whether we would see purple smoke if we added a powerful reducing agent to this substance, anhydrous hydrazine. Interesting, in this reaction we saw black smoke, which can also consist of gold particles, but of a different size. Thanks for watching, guys! I hope you enjoyed this experiment. As always, a huge thank you to my patrons. Your support allows me to keep creating unique chemical content. I truly appreciate it. And those who would like to support me can find a link to my Patreon in the description. See you in the next video.